Here's the part of the video where I pretend that I was purposely waiting until today to upload instead of admitting that I've just been lazy. <sighs> Did I say that out loud? Welcome back to the show. I'm your host, Zello Smack. And today, we're doing a spooky, scary Q&A. It seems like I'm gonna need a little bit of help with this one. So seeing as I have no friends to speak of, I'm gonna summon some demons. I don't know anything about foreign languages, so I'm just gonna plagiarize some dialogue from a video game. Telok the Vim. Fucker, I gotta stop mixing alcohol and prescription drugs that aren't mine. Agra or. He said, suck my dick, faggot, to which I said, well, I've been trying to for the last 10 minutes, but you won't let me take off your pants. Taba Ord. Throwing paper instead of money because I'm rich, but my actor is poor. Ava Vago. God damn it, we are gonna get sued if we keep ripping off characters like this. Also, what the hell am I wearing? We have nothing to lose, and neither does the idiot asshole running this channel. All right, well, I was under the impression that I was summoning demons and not you dysfunctional rejects. But we're on a budget, so I'll take what I can get. I'm sorry, I just want to say that I do not want to be here. Mm, no one cares what you think, sweetie. Yes, I agree. Shut the hell up, Daria. Keep quiet and go back to cutting your chef. I think it takes a lot of strength to suffer in silence. You, get back in the closet. And you, Mulan, get out of it so that the sperm-covered perm over there can get back in. How about I cut you a new asshore, asshore? How's about I take my metal dick here and fuck you with it until it blows its load? I am sitting between the two of you and honestly hoping that I get caught in the crossfire. This is kinkier than anything I've ever seen on Pornhub. This is the closest I'll ever be to happiness. This is getting way out of hand and needs to stop. Well, sweetie, it might help if you'd tell us why we're here. We're doing a super spooky Q&A, and y'all are my co-host today. Can I still finish? That's what she said. Who said that? Who said what? Who's on first? First what? First question. If you commit two sins at once, do they cancel each other out like a double negative? Of course they do. I'm a literal cutthroat businesswoman and a blatant rip-off character. Technically, I'm always committing two crimes at once, and I'm just fine. Can you be too old for Halloween? You can, and for the same reason pedophiles aren't interested in you after a certain age. No adult wants to give candy to anyone who's old enough to distinguish candy corn from a three-inch penis. What are your latest pet peeves? Definitely not enough things to put in my mouth. My latest pet peeve is the same pet peeve I always have. Dumb bitches asking me what kind of fucking costume I'm wearing. It's not a goddamn costume, asshar! It's the same fucking thing I wear every day. What is your dream job? I don't have one. I'm my own boss and I make millions of dollars a minute. I'm living the dream. Honestly, my actor should be taking career advice from me, but he's too busy making garbage YouTube videos to be a functioning adult. Well, first of all, define job. What is the worst job imaginable? I'd say the worst job imaginable is being a fluffer. Sure, I would get to suck a lot of dicks, but I wouldn't get to finish any of them off. In my opinion, any job that isn't mine is the worst job. I whip my employees and cripple seeing eye dogs just for fun. What are some of the happiest moments of your life? For me, it was about a minute ago when I was convinced that one of these two crazy bitches was about to kill me. The happiest moment of my life was my first prostate exam. That doctor had the biggest pair of hands I've ever seen. Scariest anal session? Wait, what exactly do you mean by that? As far as I'm concerned, all anal is good anal. Spookiest cock monster you've ever seen. Donald Trump. Not his actual cock, just him. Excuse me, bitch. Cocks aren't monsters. Every cock is a beautiful treasure that deserves love and worship. If you had to die in a horror film, how would you go and who would kill you? I want to go out as painfully and slowly as humanly possible. It would be so nice to feel something other than my chronic hemorrhoids flaring up every two hours. And honestly, I don't care who the fuck does it. If you could ship two of your favorite anime characters together, who would they be? I would probably ship myself and Naruto, because he got that fox dick and I am all about that knot. Also, could you please explain what Yaoi is and why we love it so much? What do you mean, what is Yaoi? Are you fucking stupid? Do a fucking Google search. As for why we rub it so much, do a fucking Google search, bitch. This one just says gay. That's not a question. Do jocks really wear jock straps? I know for a fact that they do. I mean, so do I sometimes, but that's for different reasons. How does Tails fly? Does he have two butts? Asking for a fanfic, I want to be accurate. He's a fucking cartoon. Since you're a gay living in Canada, and Canada doesn't really exist, does that mean you're not really gay? Well, I mean, I am a fictional persona, 
But I promise you, honey, I'm as gay as my actor is shitty. Tell us how you and Terry met. How did I meet Terry? Where I moved into this apartment and I didn't exactly have a choice in roommate, so I got stuck with this cunt. He called my work number by mistake once and we bitched each other out over the phone. I remember that fight because I won. Well, personally, I don't have a goddamn clue who any of you assholes are, so why the fuck are you asking me? If you have two dicks and have sex with a male and a female at the same time, does each dick have a gender preference? Would they be placed on top of each other or side by side? Honestly, I'm a depraved slut and probably the only person here qualified to answer that question, but even I have limits, bitch. That question was so awful I want to shoot out my own eardrums and feed them to the bastard who thought of it. Actually, they would be side by side on account of it's impossible for them to be one on top of the other. It's true. Google it. Well, this has been thoroughly excruciating and clearly a fucking mistake. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And if for some reason you actually found this enjoyable, there might be something wrong with you. Bye-bye. See y'all next time.